Hello, 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 everybody. Welcome. Welcome to a very special, uh, special day, special, special stream, special stream. Uh, I'm joined here with uh, my good friend, Josuiji Shinri. Hello. Hello, hello, Koinichiwa. Dude, we're doing, we're doing, <laughs> we're doing <laughs> movie monster smash your pass. And I know what you're thinking. What kind of sick fuck? would do this in any capacity for content. And the answer is me and Shinri. I mean, I think, I think because we, we like, we like these things. I mean, I, I, yeah, I mean, this is, this is it. I mean, what, what is there to really say? I know you guys like these things too. People like this stuff. <laughs> I mean, I wasn't supposed uh, to show this image yet, but. Oh, it's already up there. There, I already had one Oh my up God, there. it is. But, okay. but, but I think it's, it's very, it's, it's a very good one to start with. I feel, but we'll, we'll get there in a minute. Um, yeah, I originally okay. So originally, I was going to draw all of them, and I asked Shinri, "I'm like, okay, I'm gonna draw like 15, and then you draw like 15." And he's like, "Okay, I'll get them to you, you know, soon." Um, <clears throat> and then I wake up the next day, and I have DMs from Shinri. He's given me 22 of them, and they're all spectacularly drawn. <laughs> they're so good he's he did all the work for this by the way he did i've done nothing to prepare i drew mine and paint they look like shit you'll probably see like four of them because he drew ones that i already drew because i didn't tell him what i drew because i'm a professional and <laughs> i looked at his and i'm like wait no that's way better than mine wait i can actually show you my xenomorph oh you drew a xenomorph i drew a, yeah I, we should i drew one we xenomorph. Like, compare if we compared <laughs> yeah the ones that we we got if I can find, oh yeah, okay. I don't have, why is it, okay. Well, it's so big. <laughs> that's, that's mine. What, also, what is, is it do? Well, I don't, I didn't know how to draw. I don't, look at this comparison, hang on. Ow. <laughs> <laughs> that's a name. I was oh, trying to amazing. spell alien and then I just, it's, it just went into Alan. It's like Pokemon Snap, who took the better photo. Yours is so good. <laughs> I, well, to be fair, I'm on a break, so, like, I had all the time to just oh, God. turn something out. You did not need to do that. And you'll see, guys, there's, like, so many more that he did. And apparently, the one th this one apparently was rushed. He's like, ah, oh, you know, I gave up. I'm like, <laughs> you gave up? No. How there's long did so that take? many, like, bumps and bridges. The, this one, mm. I think this one took, like, three five minutes okay that's the craziest thing it's because mine took 12. <laughs> so you effectively went quicker and produced higher quality in less than half the time <laughs> so i just but, gave up but look at how dynamic and expressive <laughs> <laughs> it yeah man it has a lot of character it does a lot it of does. personality I, I like to think so um okay everybody well as 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 the title says uh me and shinri are going to do a smasher pass of classic movie monsters and some you may know some you may not know and then also just like kind of horror icons um that have been kind of been in pop culture and media for the past 100 years um i mean we yeah. could yeah we could i mean we could just we could just start with good old xenomorph the alien here smash okay so <laughs> I agree. I agree. I fully agree with you. But yeah. the problem is we need to defend ourselves now because no one agrees with this what? comment. Have you okay, first of all, have you seen it in Alien Um Isolation? It's got like a I figure. Have. It's got it's got like it's like it's like Diablo, Primeval Diablo and Diablo 3, where it's got like it's a monster, but it's got like hips and it kind of walks with like a sway. It's <laughs> it's kind of hot. Okay, wait, real quick. Let me send you a picture. Check your DMs. Okay. Um, you would, right? Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. Look at Holy those hips. Holy mackerel! It's on all fours. Like, <laughs> <laughs> I'm listen. All I'm saying is HR Geiger was on to something. HR Geiger knew what they're also you're like HR style is is too hard while you're right you kind of did it you got like all the like, ridges and shit I mean yeah okay I love HR Geiger stuff so like just look at I mean it's just it's just cool it's just it's yeah. just good looking 
Now the alien, I mean, yes, it's a little gross, but oh, but it's kind of smooth. It looks a little bony. Oh, it's so smooth. Yeah. It looks a little bony. Imagine like running your fingers along all those like ridges. <laughs> oh, fuck. The little bumps that's got. Like going down oh. a gravel road. <laughs> yeah. But it, it's like each of those little bumps themselves are like super smooth. Dude, I just like the top of its head. It looks like it would feel like the hood of like a, I don't know, a Tesla car. <laughs> or, so, or, 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 or or like, it's like those rocks. Uh, there's like these rocks. There's these shiny, I don't know what they're called. They're like these shiny rocks and they're like kind of shiny purple. Rocks. They're like, I, I feel like they're purple. They're purple, silvery, silvery, purple. Uh, yeah. uh, rock. I don't know what they're called. They're rocks and they're really smooth and they, <laughs> no, not geode. What the fuck are they called? It's a rock. It's a rock. Like like the ones that are like weathered in the beaches and like made least. Yes, I think I, yes, I think that's it. And and they feel really weird when they clack together. You can clack them together, and it's very oh, like. Oh yeah. Oh. I, I know. I know of those, but like, I don't know. The the texture is like kind of. You can get that on any kind of rock. Like. I guess that's true. If you like if you that. fucking wear it down enough. Yeah. I think what what I can say about both of our. I should have just drawn all the ones you drew so we could compare because that's funny, but I didn't. <laughs> but I think what can be said is that we both have a great attention to detail and the fact that we gave it that he classic head shine. That's, oh, part, that's yeah. what you need for the Xenomorph, that classic smooth head shine. Polished like a diamond. <laughs> it just I, mean, I just think it'd be like really nice to like touch. You know, like it, like if I had a pet alien, I would just like pat it on the head constantly. Uh, dude, like, absolutely. Like, okay, what if you kiss the alien? I get it. It's got that tongue, but does its tongue have a tongue? Oh, I hope it does. Because then you're like Inception kissing, and that's cool. That is really cool. <laughs> oh, like imagine what you what it could do. Like you're kissing, right? Oh, and like fuck. Most people, like, when they just, like, French kiss, right? They just have, like, the little the jousting match with uh -huh. the tongues, right? Uh -huh. But, like, this one would be an actual duel to the death. Dude, this would know? actually, yeah. It, my, my, my tongue is now intertwined in a battle for, for supremacy. <laughs> and if it loses, it's, it's just killed. Exactly. That's exciting. Right? Adds a little bit of a thrill, excitement. True, to exactly. Really spice things up. Okay, so yeah. So for the first one, okay, Xenomorph Smash, easy, easy answer for me. I don't know about you. Very easy. Very, yeah, easy answer. Okay, next. <laughs> oh my! The Babadook. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I actually need to look up an image of the Babadook again. That um, that's literally it. That's just the. Babadook. I know. I know. Like that's like the storybook version. But we're talking like. Whenever I, okay, so the first time I watched the Babadook, I, I, it just looks like Marilyn Manson with a big mouth. <laughs> I, it, it just looks weird. Um, oh my god! Now that you say it, you yeah, see, I, I, I was can... like laughing at the whole because it was meant to be like this scary thing, like because I love the way it looks in the storybook, like the way you drew it. It's this yeah. tall, lanky, like furry guy, and then it shows the actual Babadook, and it's Marilyn Manson, and it or or like <laughs> it, it just looks. It's a, it's a pass for me. The, the fact that it is literally just like a person's face. Yeah. That's been like brushed white right. with like the black lips and everything. I like, I feel they should have taken a bit more of like a creature entity vibe I with it. I think so as too. To just a guy to make up. I, I yeah. absolutely agree. I think, I think it could be way scarier. I, th I wish it looked more like the storybook drawing because the storybook drawing is really scary. Honestly, I think it is. I think the movie itself, it should have just been like a shadow on the wall or something. Like, I, I don't like that had like this physical dude like crawling on the wall it just it just was it didn't work for me i really like that like in the the book version the like book they, is, they just did oh, that i'm looking at the book stuff you know? right now it's so fucking cool the art is so good it is and he's scary he's got the top head he's got the giant mouth i mean i don't know i just realized now that i'm paying attention to it like his face in the comic book and his like actual makeup doesn't match like no. he doesn't have like the little eye mask they, nose they are thing not going on. similar it's very weird that like it's like a weird like Babadook cosplayer that oh, made no, it from memory. Oh no, he's catfishing. He's catfishing. We got catfish. Got catfish. <laughs> That's a pass. Fuck that. <laughs> yeah, I would have to pass on this one. So, I would say points for the hat. Points for the hat because it's nice. We listen. Nothing like a good top hat. 
We love I don't know how he hat. does it. Like when he's chasing people and like rushing them down, you know, like maybe keep, kill them. keep it on his head. Right? It doesn't move. It stays on. He's like, a tenacious guy. He's a tenacious guy. Yeah. And I, I respect that. Um, yeah. But I do not respect him enough to smash him at all. <laughs> Sorry, Babadook. Fair, fair. I, I, I like the ba I like the movie. I like the story. I like the legacy and the legend of the Baba Duke. It's cool, yeah. The Baba Duke himself, not so nah, much. Not forget it. All right. Yeah. It's a pass. All right, moving on. <laughs> Player Witch. Okay. <laughs> so this is an interesting thing because I, I want to talk about this. The Player Witch. You do not really see the witch in the original. Blair Witch, do you? Do you see a witch in that? There's, that, that doesn't have no. a look, but in the remake, there is a witch, so... Yes. So, I'm gonna yes. look at the remake. Um, Blair Witch remake. I don't even know what that looks like. Uh, she looks like... Jesus, uh, mother of God, fuck no, in a... Oh, gee, oh, it's tall and scary. Okay, okay, yes, but... Imagine the hugs. <laughs> oh, like, it's so scary. <laughs> but like, look at the arms. The arm? Okay. Like, look, look how, like, think about the hugs that she could give. They're probably w a little weird. They're gonna want, they're gonna want to film everything. They're a little bony. Yeah, but like, it's, you know, it's something you share, like arts and crafts. They're gonna share it know? to the internet. They're gonna found footage. Are smashing. I can't. I can't do this with the Blair Witch monster <laughs> thing. I just, I just, I just, I, I don't know if I could attend what they want. Either that, or they're just gonna make me stand in a corner, and that's not fun. No, but like, imagine just all the footage you can film, just all the content you can make. You we know? could. Oh, dude, we could start like a. <laughs> we could. We could run a platform, dude. Me and the Blair Witch, we'll be rich. <laughs> yeah. Also, you have all these like little arts and craft like merch you can make, like the little effigy. <laughs> not, True arts and crafts, that's fun. Called. Yeah. I mean, maybe they, maybe they'd be a good a good partner. Maybe it'd be a good. You know, I, I think like okay, I know it, the the game is smash or pass, but I don't like just going down and break it down into just smashing or passing. I also like looking at it at, like long term. What if what if. Uh, you know, what what are the benefits of Blair Witch, and it, it, would it you know withstand a relationship? Um, the answer I, I think so. is I, I think I, I, I disagree um, they're a little reclusive um, they're kind of scary and when I mean kind of I mean it's definitely the scariest thing we've seen so far I don't think the xenomorph is scary I, I, I legit think the xenomorph is hot are you um, just saying that because she has an RDF <laughs> no <laughs> she's it's because she's I don't like it. tall monstrous things that's just her noble face. Like, that's what she just looks like, you know? Uh, uh, <coughs> I mean, like, I'm sure, like, deep down inside, she's sweet. Like, she just has I, that face. So everyone thinks she's intimidating and I scary. I am sure she is a wonderful lady. Arts and crafts. You know, loves nature. Extremely cottage core. Cottage like, core. You know. Oh, if you go for that thing, yeah. <laughs> yeah, cottage, cottage core for sure. Um... All really right. good with the kids. Yeah, that's true. That's yeah. true. That's true. Yeah. I mean, and and nothing short of doing making some, and they're very mysterious because in the first, you know, know, in the original, you don't even see them. So I like exactly. I like the one you drew. That's cute. Why can't they look like that? <laughs> maybe, maybe we he may, does. <laughs> maybe you know, or maybe in the first one. No, oh, she just needs to take a shower. Like a majority of them just need to take a shower with like a nice conditioner. That can, yeah, that can be like, said literally about all of these things and probably all of Tempest. So I you yeah know. yeah you got us there. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah, but uh, Blair Witch, Blair Witch remake or not, it's smash. a pass for me. I can't believe you said Smash. You are. <sighs> it's. I, we're, I think we're just gonna find out who's like worse in this scenario. And the fact that you said Smash here is. That's fucking frightening. <laughs> that is a frightening moment. A frightening moment. Okay. Oh my. <laughs> <laughs> oh, this one. Insidious. Let's go. I was literally going to make a joke. I was trying to draw him, and I just ended up drawing Darth Maul. <laughs> <laughs> 
Okay. Oh, I mean, like you're 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 pretty much there. It's like just 80 Darth the Maul in a wig. Yeah. Does he have a name? <laughs> uh, he does have a name. Uh, it is the demon with lipstick. The demon with lipstick. Yes, because he has red lipstick on. Interesting. Um. Okay, so so first of all, I love the scare in this movie. Oh um, yeah, it really was so effective. Good. Um, he, he, you know, Patrick Wilson being in his 548th uh, possession horror movie. Uh, this one I think is my favorite. <laughs> I know there's like The Conjuring. I know he's been in the 758 different Insidious films. Um, but I I like this one. I think that was pretty scary. Um, I. Ha I liked the movie. I just didn't like. I love the first half of it, but then when it turned into like an action film that in the second every half, every horror movie. I swear to God, every horror movie. Well, I, I've ta I've talked about this in membership. I may have said this with you. There's a thing I call horror movie boss fight, and it consists of like it's the point of no return when a horror movie stops becoming scary and the thing has revealed itself, and then you're just fighting the thing that was originally scary, yeah. and it's called the horror movie boss fight. Ah, oh, you're so true for that. That is absolutely yeah. I, I don't like that. And I don't, I don't like, like that. that. I've never liked it. Keep it, keep it scary the entire time. Yeah, keep it mysterious. Like you don't have to show like the main characters beating up the demon. Like, Dude, that, exactly. That doesn't make sense. Exactly. Um. So what do we know about this guy? Well, I honestly, I'm not the red faced demon lipstick man. Um, uh, they love to gaslight. Um, only the person that's being haunted, uh, like, oh. they can choose whether they want to show themselves to it. Well, nothing uh, like a red flag to get us started with this guy. Absolutely. I'm interested. But also, very, uh, stylish, as we know. With the a little stylish, everything. yeah, you got, you know, got the hair. Yeah. Um, <laughs> I, I, I bet they're a good singer. It looks like they can really They yell. actually do sing. Yeah, oh, do they really? The, yeah, so when the father goes into, like, hell, quote-unquote hell, to defeat the demon, uh -huh. you see a scene where this demon is just vibing. Like, he's got his own, like, room, nice cushy chair, eating graves with a record player, just singing a Wait, song. Wait, what? Like, yeah, no, legit. Like, he's just having a time. So he's... Entirely on his own. He's a little classy. Yeah. Interesting. We love a guy with hobbies who takes care of himself. Now, I am seeing other images of him. Um, in later films. Yeah. I thought he had a full head of hair. He's Oh no, it's kind of like patchy. He's yeah. bald at the top and it's black paint and so he has clown hair. <laughs> Look at this image. Oh, you're talking about the, the, the later ones where he's like shaved head. Yeah. Oh, yeah. No. yeah. <laughs> it's he's I'll be honest, the more I look at him, he's horrific. He is scary, yeah. I, I don't I don't think I, I'm not vibing with this guy. I mean, nothing like a little gaslight to make things interesting, but I, I just I'm th I'm thinking, you know, he's got yeah, yeah, okay, you know, I'm just I'm cooking dinner in the hypothetical universe where I do that. And mm -hmm. he comes up behind you and he and he surprises you. I feel like he'll always just come up behind you and scream at you. It'd be scary. I don't wanna get scared all the time. I need to I need to have some downtime. He looks really I know, intense. But like but but look at that. He's just sitting on the toilet, just like doing his thing. <laughs> you know, like he's just like you or me. I mean, that's a little guy. I mean, the guy you drew there, <laughs> the little Saitama looking guy that you drew there. I I feel like that would be us in the relationship after we have like been accustomed <gasps> to their bullshit. You know, we're like, yeah, oh. <laughs> hey, babe. <laughs> ah! They're just screaming at all times. And you're like, just fucking doing taxes. Oh, no. <laughs> And I, I gotta be honest, in the depiction you have here, they look a little unamused. You know, they, they seem, they seem a little. And I, you know, I don't want to judge too much off of off of the Saitama Patrick Wilson rendition that you drew, but um, I, I'm just, I'm just kind of putting it here that I just feel like it would get a little old. It would get a little old. We're gonna end up as that mother from the Baba Duke. Why can't you just be normal? Why can't and then you the just, just be normal? Ah, like screaming in the back seat. <laughs> That's all it's doing. <laughs> it's a pass for me. I would say, like, taking everything into consideration, also a pass. But if it's just, like, the physical body, I would smash. Really? Okay, so if you're going off of physicality and looks, it's a smash. See, not, not even that for me. I Maybe I'm a freak, because I'm like the xenomorph. I'm like, oh, fuck yeah, look at those fucking 
look at the geometry on that thing. And then I see him like this dude. I'm like, eh, it's just a wrinkly old demon freak. I mean, yes, but like he seems so small. <laughs> he just he, he probably needs love. Maybe that yeah. maybe he'll stop screaming over time. But exactly. as, as, from, you know, what we know about him. <laughs> the, mm. the thing you send that image, is that from the movie? No, that I think that's that looks like it's from scene. something else. That looks like <laughs> that, look, that looks like the R eighteen like spoof version of Insidious. He sent me a behind the scenes footage of him, and it's this grainy, awful painted, weird looking version of like this demon dude, and he's like just sitting there. It looks so weird. That looks so bizarre. Where'd you find that? Is on the wiki? No, it's just like Google images. Just Google images. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Okay, so it's a pass, but uh, uh, Smash for you it, uh, based off physicality, which is normally what, how the game goes, but we're, we're giving it a little bit more depth. Okay. Yeah. <sighs> okay. <laughs> Hellraiser slash Ubu Razor. Now. <laughs> now. First of all. Oh, wait, I think I drew this guy. I need, oh. to, fi I need to find mine. Let's see, let's see. I drew, Compare. I drew this guy. I hope I can find him. Wait, what the fuck? What I name it? Uh oh. <laughs> I'm gonna have to open up paint, maybe. I don't know if I saved it in paint. It might it, I like mine. Eight, seven. Oh, oh, six. What the did I not save it? This is why you label. Your files when you <laughs> save them. Wouldn't that just be a treat? If you're just trying to go through like 700 different files, they're all just variations of Key Smash, oh. ASDF, JKL. Oh, no, I don't know if I. What the fuck? I liked mine. I actually tried as hard as you did for one of them. Oh? I wanna uh, see, I wanna see, I wanna see. I, I, I've, I've lost it. No. Hang, hang, hang on. I'm going into the depths real quick. <laughs> okay. October 28th. What do we have here? Untitled Paint. That sounds... Oh my god, I fucking... F I found it. Okay. Oh, oh, let's go, let's go. Okay. So. I'll show you mine. Waiting intensifies. Ma imagine if I did this like. <laughs> okay, come on. Atta boy. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. I don't know his name. <laughs> but I just put Pinhead Larry. Okay. Now. <laughs> Interesting. Yours is adorable. Yours is so cute. He's got little hearts on the ends of him. Um, <laughs> so I don't know too much about Hellraiser. I know there's like a Pandora's box kind of thing, and they are like, I mean, they're like, they're from hell. I mean, they're like hell people, and there's like all kinds of twisted hell shit, like pain, torture, fear, you know, just pretty much the worst things imaginable. Yeah. For somebody, I mean, for somebody, that sounds pretty epic. You know, that for someone, someone's loving that. That's where all the fun is, isn't it? Dude, this this guy, I all I'm gonna say is probably out of all of these, this guy's gotta be freaky. This guy's gotta be so freaky. Oh, like, to, to the thing, and like, he's wearing that big leather, like trench coat, like robe the thing. thing. He's leather. Uh, dude, the whole thing. Exactly. Exactly. Um. <laughs> Let me look at it. Let me look at the real version. Um, good old I think pinhead. it's like the the stoicism because oh. he doesn't actually show much emotion. N I like, like him. Whenever, right? I like him. I'm the not. I'm, he's like cool. Life. Yeah, a little mysterious, a little stoic. I feel he'd be really mean, <laughs> though. Uh, maybe too mean. But oh, hang on. Okay, let me. I want to read just a little bit about this guy. All right. Um. So. Okay, 
Okay, yeah, okay, that's what that's what they're called. Cenobites. Yeah, he's a Cenobite and he's known as the Hell Priest. Or yeah. pi or Pinhead. Well that sounds epic. Um he's also like <laughs> twenty eight feet tall or something. That's pretty cool. I don't know how yeah. tall he is actually, but um I mean put it this way. Put it this way. He's in hell. I think yes. it would be to our benefit in a selfish way without any kind of physicality involved. Let's say you weren't the best person on earth and you got sent to hell, but guess who's waiting for you? Your hunk Aww. of a boyfriend, pinhead, hell priest, Larry. <laughs> it has to be a smash for me. I, I, I don't, I, I, I has to be. I think I'm, I'm, I'm down. I, I don't think the pins in his face stop me. It's a little I, scary. I, it'd be difficult to make out with and like sleeping together. Like he would have to be small spoon because I, I don't want those pins <laughs> like rubbing into the back of my head if I was small spoon. Dude, but the, the pins. Okay, all I'm saying is that like there is a gap. He doesn't have pins in his mouth, so there's like an open space opposed to how I drew it, where I put pins all over his mouth. But he does have open space. Um, dude, he's got kissable lips. He's at least very voluptuous. I don't know. I like this guy. Also, <laughs> I'm sorry to the actor that played him, I guess. I'm looking at this fictitiously. Okay, I don't want to freak out whoever the fuck played Pinhead. <laughs> I like him. I like his little dark circles around his eyes. I like his big, like, leather trench coat thing. I the like dark him. circles are very, very aesthetic. Yeah, it's cool. Yeah. It's cool. Um, And, you know, you have a friend in hell. I mean, and, and if you don't go to hell, well, you know what? That's a W. You didn't go to hell. But if you did, you got your, you got but your. Then you're fucking... committing to a long distance relationship. Like, <laughs> that's the thing. That's the big oh, problem. Oh, God! Making fucking... long distance relationships work is really difficult. That is, you know, transcending afterlives. That's that's truly something special. <laughs> that's crazy. Yeah. Oh, should I should. I mean. Hmm. No, okay. No, you're right. You're right. Like physically, smash. But like, with everything else, I don't know. I feel like conceptually a little scary, a little lot of work. You know, you gotta go. What you gotta get, or you gotta misbehave maybe in in heaven. You know, get cast down. Whoa! Mm -hmm. What did you post? Who's that? That's a lady Cenobite pinhead. Yeah, it's a reboot. There is a reboot from Hellraiser. Holy mackerel! Yeah. Well, that's a smash for me too. <laughs> Just I look mean, at like the the veiny like sinew on the neck. Oh, that is honestly you said that and made it really gross. That is gross. Like, I thought that was like clothes. I don't. You just said veiny sinew on the neck, and you're surprised that I said that was gross. It's oh, okay. It's I a mean, like no, no, no. It, 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 like it legitimately. It's like just chunks of skin being torn away. Okay, that's and disgusting. Then, that's disgusting. <laughs> I'm. You're, but but I, I'm not. I'm not turning away just yet. I'm not turning away just yet, but it's it's a, that's a little disgusting. Now, there's also a Cenobite. There's two other Cenobites that I'm aware of, and they are yeah. just the most rotten, vile, disgusting things I've ever seen in my entire life. One is a big, fat thumb thing with glasses. Um, hang on, I'm gonna post them. Um, <laughs> I know this. I know this doesn't help viewers, but th to those know, they know. Um, oh. And then one looks like Nemesis from Resident Evil, but not hot, who I also I should have drawn. If you guys are wondering, Nemesis Resident Evil is a smash. Anyway. Um, oh, look at that mouth, though. That, dude, that guy's got that guy's got some chompers. It does. That smile, the pearly whites. They're disgusting and I hate them. OK. OK, so <laughs> a smash for me for Pinhead. How about you? Yeah, smash. OK. Based. Based. Okay, moving on. <laughs> a Dementor. I'm sorry. I don't know why I draw. I I drew this is the good. Dementor so stacked. First of all, it... known for their sucking. I'm just. Yes. I, I'm just saying. I'm just. I'm. I'm putting that on the board. No, I'm just. I'm just saying it. It's that's what they're known for. All right. I mean, yeah. they, they. They. You know. I mean, that thing is like a fucking. That's a Dyson ball vacuum. $600 thing, <laughs> Dementor, I mean, pretty pretty crazy, pretty crazy, I mean, and listen, it doesn't even need to be a loot thing, you know, I mean, it's like, you know, and Dementor is, oh. They won't let go until they drain all of them out. <laughs> See, now, that's a lot. 
That's that. That's a little scary. Now I'm scared. <laughs> They're going to kill me. I mean, like, once they latch on, they won't stop until they got all of it, you know? Okay, so they're gonna turn me into a husk. Um, I'm- that's horrific to me. Also, I'm looking at images, I thought they were just shrouded figures, and they didn't have- they're kind of ring wraith like I thought they didn't have face. they definitely have faces. Oh yeah, no, they do. Um... They're gross. Like, it's- it's basically just the mouth. It- that- I can't- I cannot believe I- I'm right here saying this live in uh, in the presence of people, but you're literally correct. It's, yes. it's just this thing. I mean, it's just, it's just a fucking floating suck suck machine. I mean, that's what it does. <laughs> I mean, what do you what do you fucking want from me? I mean, we, I mean, we're playing Smash or Bats. It's a fucking floating suck machine. It's a I'm Smash. Dementor. Yeah. Smash. I mean, I'm mean, pretty pretty. I feel like I feel like the answer is apparent enough. <laughs> Smash. Smash. No, no need to yeah. elaborate any further. Oh, Jesus Christ, Pennywise. Okay. <laughs> I don't Pennywise. know why he has this weird mango-shaped head when I Dude. drew Dude, okay, I also drew Pennywise. I'm gonna say right now, hard pass on Pennywise, because he's got a thing for children, and it's like, not that in a good way. That is fucking weird. I don't like that. This guy's yeah. a freak. Right? Like, I saw, was it the remake where he tried to, like, scare the adults? And it's kind of like, yeah. They didn't care. Like, the the party tricks work with children. They don't uh -huh. really work with adults, you know? Dude, like, I, I, I agree. Yeah. I, 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 <laughs> I do not like Pennywise. Um, but, <laughs> You're I mean. Trying. His uh, I mean, head looks more like a balloon <laughs> than the actual balloon. I mean, I'll level with you. <laughs> It posed a popular demand. I hate clowns. I hate clowns with all my being. So <gasps> I don't like them. I think they're weird. Um, and I think they're everyone gross. knows that uh, clowns are the mortal enemies of jesters. Dude, exactly. Like I'm natural. not a clown, and they're like they're just worse jesters. Sorry, clowns. I just think I just think <laughs> jesters have a level of class that clowns they don't do. provide because the clowns are a different form of entertainment that I do not um, agree with. <laughs> um it is it's a fuck no from me with pennywise i don't think he's cool i don't think he's hot i mean he turns into a, a big thing filled with teeth and shoots out lasers or something i i just it's a fuck oh. no oh wait where we where are you gonna where are we gonna pick for between like pennywise or like pennywise is true for him? okay so now you're interested when he became a giant gaping maw is, i mean is, is, that, is that is that changing the tide for you a little bit. Actually. I want you to know he has seven hundred thousand rows of teeth. Okay, it's gross. I know, but imagine like brushing those teeth. <laughs> I would not. I would not even get close to his teeth. <laughs> and let alone, you know, <laughs> him. So I. I. It's just. It just. It. It's a. It's a. It's a no. It's an. I can't. I can't. I literally. I can't. I can't. I can't. I can't. It's gross. He's gross. I can't even get into it with him. I hate clowns. I hate Pennywise. I hate a stupid balloon. I hate his weird thing for children. <laughs> he can die. Yeah. Pass. 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 <laughs> Thanks, Pennywise. Oh, Jesus. Okay. Well, we're really coming back to what we just talked about. Oh, yeah. Oh, my God. No. Shinri. Look at the fucking teeth on that thing. Imagine the suction. No, bro. No, no. It has to. <laughs> Listen, the Dementor made sense. I am. I am a man. I am a man. Okay. I, I get it. You could. You could sell me on that. I'm not going to be like turn a blind <laughs> eye to that kind of fact. That thing is monstrous. Yeah. You got that big. Uh, was it angry dog energy? <laughs> you know, like you would be so safe walking down the street. They would be. With the they would be very part. defensive. Exactly. Right. Like, right. they would guard you with their lies, and they have the strength to back it up. I mean, okay, as, as a, maybe as a relationship, I like the way they look. Okay, I think they're, yeah. I think, I think they're quite distinguished. Mm -hmm. Um, taking, you know, I'm, I'm going to take, like, the, 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 the lewdness aside for all this. That's a no for me. I forget that. Looking mm -hmm. at this thing at, at a, at a reasonable level, tall, 
pretty fit. Pretty yeah, fit. Um, yeah. But here's the issue. It doesn't have a fucking brain. It's it's very primal. I don't like that. It's just a it's primal. They they do have some like sapience. Like they're not able to like logic and reason and all that, sure, but like they, they are aware of things, you know. <sighs> but no, I, I suppose you're right if we're looking at it like in, in the terms of like an animal, it is more of a beast. It's than, it's, like... it's it's it is one of the it's probably one of the most monstrous things. Um that we've 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 been at so far. I I, I don't think I can shake it with this one. But I like, can't. Imagine the kisses. It would it would I mean it doesn't really have what do you kiss? You kiss the flap? No no no, you stick your head inside it and then, and then it you kiss its tongue what? out at you. The tongue Does it have a tongue? Yeah. It like comes out of the hole. Oh it actually wait, it has a tongue? Are you sure? I do I'm so <laughs> oh my god, it does! Oh, ew, what the fuck? What the fuck is that first thing? That's like an original, like, D&D demo. Oh, no, that, that was the, um, that was the Pennywise true form of the original movie. Wait, that's Pennywise? Oh, that's in the old one, right? Yeah, the old one, yeah. Yeah, that looks Not disgusting. Okay, Demogorgon does have a tongue of some kind. Um, it would be, okay, it will be pretty good at, it will be good at kisses, maybe. But also, like, where do I put, I, 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 uh, no. Just look how wet it is. Dude, it doesn't work for me. It's too dangerous. <laughs> you're surrounded on all sides if you were to kiss that thing. It's it's fucking dang. It's got the teeth on you're you are surrounded. <laughs> it's just a little it's just a little hazardous. It's a, just a little difficult, I feel. I think it would make it a little exciting. Just put yeah. you on the on the edge of, you know, it's like, oh man, is my face gotta get ripped off? Well, like, uh, some people use, you know, whips, other people use paddles, and then even others still use, like, hot wax. Okay. Like, the Demogorgon game has teeth. I mean, that's a lot. That's a lot of teeth, and it's also in the vicinity of my face, and where my face also ha is my head, and that's where my that, brain yeah, is. Yeah, that's the whole... That's the whole point. It's supposed to make you feel threatened. Oh. I know what you're trying to say, and I respect it. <laughs> I respect it. I, if, if, you, if you go for it, I will not deny you. But... It's a pass for me. I can't do it. I'm looking at the, I've been looking at the same. Okay, I'm going to show you the image I've been looking at. <laughs> I've been staring at this for five minutes since we've been talking, and I could, I just can't get around it. Oh, I can tell you why you're staring at it. No, oh, no, bro. No, yeah, I mean, yeah. I don't. Oh. oh, my. No, that, that, <laughs> that ain't it for me. The, 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 so it's, I think that's supposed to be saliva, but that's way too white to be saliva. It, it is, that is very, uh, that is a lewd official. Oh, wait. This That's is a very a, creepy it's, color. It's, it's art station. Uh, that is a very lewd image of a, of a demogorgon, and it's probably the lewdest <laughs> that we could probably get. Um, yes. At the, when I just type in demogorgon, <laughs> um, that's gross. Uh, it's a no. It's a no. I can't. I can't. It's a, it's it's a pass. It's a pass. I can't do it. Gross. Physically smash, but I would not date. Would not. Marry. Oh, you would not. Okay. 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 I respect it. I respect it. <laughs> All right. Moving on. Okay. Okay. Did, what was the name for this? This looks like the. Okay, so I actually drew two of these, um, but okay. they're like generic, long, black-haired Asian ghost girl. Like, like the in, Grudge or just any kind of... The Ring and yeah. How could you say <laughs> pass on this? First of all, you made them cute. Yeah. I mean, yeah. I mean, yeah, I get it. Like the classic Japanese, like uh, evil kind of spirit, you know, with the with the, the, the kind of like the baggy white... Um, clothes and and you know the long black hair and it, i mean I, I i don't really think there's much debate on this one there's not much to say nope. other than it's like i mean they're kind of scary let me look up the grudge are they no even the grudge isn't that scary look at her eyes they're just so pretty the grudge is kind of pretty i don't like when they get all like contortiony and they fucking fall down the stairs that's a little scary I think that's really cool, though. It like, is cool, but like maybe an acrobat? maybe don't be like making sounds when you do it, like clicking and shit. <laughs> Take note, Battle doesn't like clicking in the bedroom. <laughs> Hang on. No, no, she's just cute. Look at that. Just. 
No, I'm I, I'm down. I'm down. Uh, smash for me. Easy. Smash. It's a monster, monster thing. Okay. Yeah. Oh! Slender Man. Yeah. Slender Man. Absolute smash. It's fucking Slender Man, man. You can look. Distinguished look gentleman. Well dressed. A little mysterious. Those, those tentacles. He's got the tentacles. Ugh. Ah, those tentacles. He's got those tentacles, which is ah, that's a little weird. And he's no, he's, no, no. You mean creative? <laughs> he's an artist. Yeah. He's an artist. You're right. <laughs> he's got. He, he is. He's an artist. Also, I will say, I think really, really tall things freak me the fuck out. It won't change it. I think faceless things in general are kind of hot. Like, yes. like just like masked faceless things. I like that. He's wearing a suit, big points. Probably the best one on the list so far. Besides yeah. the Xenomorph, which I'm biased to. <laughs> I like the fact that like his, his like faceless head acts as a template. Like you can kind of in your head imagine how hot he is. Just like anyone has he like is, their own oh, style. You have your, um, you, he, the imagination. You know, exactly. it leaves a lot to be, you know, thought about and you can create this very, that's, that's the, the mystery is fun with yeah. Slender Man. I, I completely agree. 100% smash. It's easy. Smash for smash for Slender Man. Easy. Yeah. Oh my. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Jigsaw <laughs> slash Billy the puppet. Okay. Um, I also drew a Billy slash, um, I think it's Nate, his name's Billy, but I also just call him I also just call him Jigsaw. Like, Yours is so good. I love that you gave a little bow tie. <laughs> yeah, I had to. It's iconic for me. Okay, so Billy the It's a fucking puppet, bro. Yes. <laughs> you sounded excited. <laughs> no, no, no. I'm just saying okay, I'm just Okay, okay, okay. <laughs> okay, so we look at Billy the Puppet. Uh first of all. It's a fucking puppet. It's made out of goddamn wood. I will say yes. this, you know, <laughs> smash, smash wise, it, it's already passed for me. But looks wise, I love the look of Billy the puppet. I think he's funny. I think he looks funny. I, I love the yeah. look of him. I think he's 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 got. I and mean, you know what? He's well dressed. He's got the he's well dressed. He's got a good, good head of hair on him. Mm hmm. Yep. He's got a good head of hair on him. Um. But at the end of the day, for me personally, it's a goddamn wooden puppet that rides a tricycle and he tortures people which maybe you know if you're into that but but i mean like in my mind uh billy the puppet isn't really like a entity it's just a toy it, so yeah like... it's it's well it's being controlled by john kramer or whatever and he's just some old dude that's kind of a freak <laughs> yeah which is also just a pass you know and, and... oh my god wait is is he a vtuber <laughs> Wait a second! He's, he's, he's John Kramer. I mean, he puts it on the TV and he puppeteers. He it. I mean, he's technically a VTuber. <laughs> Hello, chat. Today we're going to play a game. Oh my god! He even plays games too. Yeah, that's right. We're gonna play a game. Happy Wheels. <laughs> Wait a second. Oh my god! No, see now I can't smash because it's like. It's like a coworker That's now. That's true. You know? I, 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 it feels exactly, weird. Exactly. Exactly. I'm. I, we, we are in the same medium of entertainment. It would. It, it's. It's. It's just too strange. Yeah. You don't poop while you eat. Like <laughs> it, it's just bad. Bad juju. Do that. <laughs> Billy the puppet, the VTuber, uh, is a hard pass <laughs> from me. Hard pass. If it was just the toy. I'd smash, but okay. like okay. with everything else that comes it's along too, with it. too man. much going on with Billy the puppet. Yeah. <laughs> what is this? Oh, yeah. Okay, so this is like another like classic like like spirit. Okay, you drew one of these already, right? The same kind of thing. Yeah. Okay. But like, I wanted to make sure this one was like very clearly like, oh, she's from the ring because you can see the well behind her. I don't know anything about the ring. I mean, okay. First of all, is the girl from the ring? Are they, is she like a girl? Is that like, I don't even want to say yes, anything. Yes, it okay. is a girl. Okay, so, it but, is a girl. but like, okay, so then it's a fucking hard pass for me. I mean, we can't, I can't even, you know, fucking, no. Um, but 
I, so like the story is like when she was born she has like psychic powers and the like family, she's like she's like of... young right she's like a kid right fuck i can't we can't right i mean that's like i don't know how i don't know the thing with the ring chick I, I yeah i think she died when she was like a teen okay okay yeah so it's like that yeah. so but but if we're going off of your drawing and we're going off of like japanese spirit girls yeah or whatever. Oh, I guess the ring girls in Japanese, huh? They're like, they're like just from the fucking ring. I, I've never seen the ring. They come on the fucking TV. I mean, there, there's like the American, um, like remake of it, but like in, in most of the interpretations, they're all. Let's like, put it conceptually like this: it's just a spirit, you know, person that comes out of the TV. Okay, a spirit person comes out of the TV, and we, we just we're just gonna look at it conceptually and not the one from the fucking ring, so people don't get fucking weird and and yeah. point fingers at like weird shit. Okay, so let's just look at it conceptually. As as you know, a, a woman if that comes out of the fucking a, TV, like a okay, adult spirit, like a yeah. Um, so putting it this way, ooh, woo fingy touch. It does a woo fingy touch. It comes out of the TV, which is terrifying. <laughs> um, no, no, okay. Here, here, here's the thing. The TV part isn't the terrifying part, right? What you do is you invite her over, but you call with your phone. So she has to come through your phone screen <laughs> as opposed to your monitor oh, screen. This, like, this is like the meme. Right? This is like the remake, the 2022 remake. Exactly, exactly. So when she comes out, she's like super tiny, like pocket size, and then you you know have a little. <laughs> but, pet. Wait, could you, okay, so like wait, small. It, did she change size depending on the screen that she comes out of? Like, hey, she listen. has to physically crawl through the portal, whatever oh, size shit. the portal is. So like, as long as you have a very tiny screen, like. She can only be restricted to that size. Hey, babe, you won't believe it. I am at the IMAX theater right now. <laughs> giant fucking, giant. You know fucking how I told you I wanted you to step on me. Now is the chance. <laughs> Just giant monster woman coming out of the fucking screen. Oh um, my god, that would actually be really fun. I kind of like the whole hidden. I'm looking at a um the like the original with like the hit the the hair down on the face thing. Like you don't see it. I kind of like. I kind of I I like that. I think it's I think it's cute. Like they're those mysterious fucking, um, you know whatever the fuck. Yeah. I, I'm I don't know. I I I I'm I'm down. You know yeah. I'm down. I'm down. I'm down. I'm down with the with the ring uh well monster thing uh or or like TV crawling spirit woman, um is what I it, <laughs> for TV crawling spirit woman. Uh, from no particular franchise, uh, I will say Smash. For, yeah, yeah, Smash. I'm done. Smash. I mean, come on. I mean, and also very like, um, yeah, like you said, you know, it's like you're watching TV. Boom. Hey, I'm watching TV. Come over. Instant. Boom. <laughs> out of the TV. Hey, babe, my parents are told. <laughs> <laughs> Boom. Out of the TV. And you're just ready to go right there. Yeah. Yeah. No. Very cute. Very no, cute. No, no. I love your drawing. Okay. Yeah. Oh! Mars attacks <laughs> Martian alien man. This is one of my favorite, this is my favorite alien design besides like the Xenomorph. This is such a classic. It is so like iconic. I hope everyone has seen it. <laughs> Good movie. I love the, I, I love the look of this. He's, oh, I love, I don't know why I have such a thing for like brains coming out of the head. Like I like, you know, I'm not necessarily attracted to it, but design-wise, I love the look of the brain-headed, bulging-eyed thing with the, the... Oh, I, I love this guy. I really want to just, like, rub my fingers all over <laughs> those bumps. <laughs> and give him an aneurysm. Yes. But, like, it, w it would feel so cool. Dude, touching a brain? Yeah, he'll be squishy. Also, you know they're really smart. You know, okay, because they're the ones visiting us. Nothing you know, like not the other a way smart, a, I, I, intelligence. Perfect. That's what you. That's that's great. I I, I very much value that intelligence. Yeah. I bet, and also very um, established. Has his own like army and like, you know. I mean, yeah. they are very much put together as 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 a person. This this the alien emperor of Mars attacks. And we gotta say, like, I love it when they take initiative. That's dude takes charge. Exactly. Good stuff from from the Mars attacks, Emperor Alien. Um, I will say the, you know, he doesn't have lips, so it's like you know, not not a real kissable thing. 
just just run run your tongue against all the teeth. That's all I gotta do. It's like a little gums, that, that just... that's oh dude, that is a weird mental image. I like felt that. You know how you can look at something and you 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 know the thing where you're like you can look at something and you and you can imagine yourself licking it, you will know what it feels like if you licked it. That's like a real thing, yeah. right? So like I'm I mean you can do that right now. Like you can just run your tongue. I against, literally like, thought about it because I know my teeth. I'm like, yeah, that okay, that that's tongue on teeth. That by the way, not pleasant in my mind. <laughs> that is not pleasant. Um, play it like a xylophone. <laughs> also, I don't know if he blinks, which is a I little. I don't think he can blink. No, no he eyelids. Have the eyelids. Little yeah. scary. I don't know if they sleep. <laughs> I don't like the no eyelids part because, like, if you're trying to, if you go in to kiss someone, right? Yeah. But they're just like wide eyed. That's a little at scary. You the and then you open your eyes, and it's just fucking darting at you with its fucking big scary alien eyes. Regardless of that, I'm still. I'm still I'm still down. I'm still down with the alien emperor. I love the alien yeah. emperor. I I just the Martian leader. Um you know, yeah, takes Smash charge. Smash but a one night stand for me. Yeah, I'm, I'm, well, I think I don't know if I I don't know if I'd be able to commit. See, I'm the opposite. So it's like, you know, but Smash is not like on the table cuz it's Smash or pass, but for me, I think, you know, long-time partner would be great. I mean, we could travel the galaxy. It would be fun. Really? We could we could, I mean, they are they are put together. They they know what they're about. You know, they got I know, followers. But I, and... I I feel like he's one of those guys who's really like married to the job. Oh, like he's got his career involved you in know? his work. Yeah, and we'll have exactly. time for me, maybe. Yeah, that's what I'm worried about. Because I won't be an alien. I won't be invading Earth. I'll just be back at the mothership. You know. Exactly. But he's gonna be something. like, "Hey, babe, I'm gonna be gone for like two months while I go yeah. take a look at this planet." It's, it's like true. another work. It's conference it is thing. A, it's a very good point. Yeah, it's a very good point. Um, maybe like after he's conquered the solar system, he's ready to settle down. Yeah, maybe I'll wait. You know? I mean, that might take too long. I mean, maybe they have cryogenic freezing. I'm like, listen, hey, um, hey, babe, listen, I'm going to go into the cryogenic freezing pod for 258 years, and when you're done conquering the solar system just just get me out you know just get me out we can kind of just continue and, and settle down just kick it off right where we yeah. left it yeah exactly yeah. on a planet that you haven't destroyed yet exactly um <laughs> smash for me martian leader love him smash okay yeah. respect okay <laughs> good old fred krueger good old fred krueger oh. now there's a lot of things to think about with him yes um because he enters your dreams, mm -hmm. right? He enters your dreams, which means yeah. technically he can kind of be whatever, whatever this is true, you want. But like, but do do you really want to end up as the? <laughs> <laughs> but bro, I real this is the first one I drew, by the way. So if they only get worse, <laughs> so I decided to give some kind of background. I, I guess, like, for me, the thing that I worry is, like, you, no one else can see him, you know? Okay. So, like, I'll take a selfie and then be, like, you know, uh, just hanging out with my boo. And yeah, then, it'll, yeah. like, for everyone else to just see me, like, uh, they won't be able to see Freddy, right? So, I, I don't know, like, the optics of it. Damn. Okay. I'm sure he'd be, like, real freaky in a dream. But, like, see, outside the, of the that? freakiness, okay, but the smash mechanics, you know, looking at the base value of smash for Freddy Krueger, I mean, if, if, you know, he could turn into a fucking train if someone's into that, you know, it's like he could do whatever your dreams desire. That's, that's probably <laughs> like the most, that's like the best smash yet because he could do whatever, right? And it's your dream, so it's your mind, right? I mean, I guess it, it, it doesn't really work that way. You don't control him, but if he were, I, I, I'm looking at this at a non-malicious standpoint. Right. Mm. At a non malicious standpoint. So he's like, ah, oh, dude, have a good night. I'll see you in your dreams. First of all, very romantic. Second of all, they, they know they would know what you know what I would like. They would know what I would like and and, and transform into whatever the fuck. Um or be or be Ooh. whatever or or whatever else. Um he's kind of a dick. I will say. Yeah. He's kind of a dick. He always calls people like bit. bitch and stuff. <laughs> <laughs> um, I feel like he's a little aggressive for my liking. He's a little, he, he, he comes on a little strong. Um, he, 
he kind of strikes me as like that college boyfriend you'll have who's okay. kind of like really aggressive okay yeah yeah and yeah. like has a big personality but is also kind of like a little manipulative a little bit gaslighty like being inside your mind at all times and just kind of haunting you from inside it's a bit there. dangerous like knows all the, it's like snooping through your phone without yeah. permission and it, i don't I and know, he might find like... things that he may not like and he will use that against me you know if, if, exactly. he, if he goes into the the back walls of my mind he's like oh who who is this the xenomorph and i'm like listen like, it, was, it, was a, it was a it was a one-time thing man I, and it was I, I i was gonna tell you and then you know it, it, it'll spiral so you're right i feel like someone that is inside your mind should not be someone that you should ever really let in in any kind of intimate way I mean, like, at some point in the future, maybe, but, like, he starts out this way. True, you know? so exactly. That, that's, it, that's too much at the exactly. beginning of the relationship. You make a very good... You know what? You have sold me. I was 100% pedal to the metal smash with Freddy Krueger based off <laughs> based off what he was he was about and what he what he can do. Uh, but you... I mean, you no, you, you're right. It, it, that's dangerous. That, that's yeah. too much. You don't want... You, you, nobody <laughs> needs to know 100% of my mind. Nobody needs to know. And Do even, we even know 100% of our own minds? No, so he'll find something, like, fucking insane or something. I don't know. So, so yeah. but, okay, so people are saying one night stand. Okay, so one night stand, I mean, but he, still, the problem is you let him in, right? Yeah. And, 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 and what if he's clingy? You can't escape him. Everybody sleeps. So it's like, yep. you know, if if he wants to be with you forever and you're not, you're not, eh, then you're fucked because he, he gets to decide. He gets yeah. to decide. That's too much power. That is way too much power for for one one monster man. Mm -hmm. Exactly. Yeah. You know. You know what? And he would make the the breakup would just be catastrophic. You know, the worst ex you could I ever Im imagine. Imagine breaking up through a dream. Oh, oh my goodness! And then like he'll come to you like crying in your dreams. And then <laughs> he'll be going through all the stages of like you know he'll be he'll be sad. Then he'll, but, but the, you don't want the days when he's angry because. Lord have mercy on Dream You. <laughs> oh my god, you're just like Freddy, like I'm just trying to sleep. I just yeah. need a rest, man. Like you wanted this. We we like just please oh, come give on, me man. Some space. But he's instead he Star Wars title scroll projects his text message <laughs> of what is going on. How do we go wrong? What happened? It's just fucking and it and it's the <laughs> longest dream ever. It feels like a month oh watching, my god. just reading the shit. If um, you just like cycle through like different scenes from movies, like Freddy's outside your like balcony window <laughs> with the the, the music keeps player, trying, yeah, just... he's trying to get you back in fifteen hundred different ways. <laughs> you know what? I was so I was so down, and now you know what? It is a mother of fuck no, probably the worst one yet. When I just said he was the best, worst one, <laughs> terrible. No, 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 Fred for me. It's a pass. Yeah, pass for me. Too much, too, yeah, exactly, too dangerous. <laughs> oh, Jesus Christ, Slimer! Let's go! Slime! Okay. Okay. I know, okay. Shinner, you don't need to say it. He's got an enormous mouth. Okay, I get it. All right. <laughs> He's got the biggest mouth you've ever seen in your entire fucking life. I wasn't going to say anything about the mouth. Okay, and he's slimy and... Okay. Okay, the sliminess, 10-10. Amazing, right? Yep. But the bonus points from the slime is not enough to, I like get over the fact that Slimer is more like a pet than an actual <laughs> oh, entity, okay. and like I can't, like I don't, I don't know if like Slimer can, like, hold a conversation. I'll be honest, you know? Slimer is disgusting looking. I hate the look of Slimer. I hate that he's like gross. I don't like gross people and things. Like you know, speaking, I feel like they'd be a slob. God no! I, I for... feel like I feel like Slimer like is ugly, but like is ugly in the way pugs are ugly. Like they just oh. overlap and go all the way around. To just okay, kind of so he's kind of he's kind of cute. I guess I guess you're right. In in like a weird fucked up like ugly way, he's yeah he's exactly. he's yeah he's, he is kind of cute. But it I mean <laughs> first of all it's a ghost. I mean does he have any physicality? Does a ghost have? Uh... Yes, uh, Slimer does play pranks, uh, and he's able to get his ectoplasm on, onto people. Just okay, okay. In a playful way, yeah. Okay, ectoplasm, I mean, that's like, that's, that's, that's something. That's something, they, they got something there, but it's definitely not, an, I mean, it's, it's fucking, I don't like Slimer. I can't. 
<laughs> I can't. It's a, I mean, no, it's gross. It's I gross. would hang out with Slimer, but I wouldn't smash Slimer. Okay, I think Slimer's, yeah, maybe Slimer's chill. Yeah. But I, I would not date, and I would definitely not smash Slimer. It's a, it's a no for me. It's a pass. A pass from Slimer. Yeah. Sorry, Slimer. Great drawing, by the way. <laughs> I love these. Oh, Jesus oh. God. So is this, oh. a, is this a Wendigo? No, he, um, Motor is actually what it, is known as a Yotun. Oh, it's a Yotun. Okay. Yeah. Um, This thing is fucking terrifying, Shinri. Ah, the hugs, though. But it's got... It's multi-layered, I guess. It's a big, big thing, but... You will never get bored. Yeah. Oh. It's... Uh, uh, you can go from the front, the side, <laughs> behind, underneath, on top. Like, look at all of those. <laughs> I don't. Okay, so what? Is, I don't know what this thing's about. What is it? Like, what does it do? Is it? Is it like a, a moose monster man? Because it's got a person. It's got like a thing. A person with like a brain shit on like the front, but it has like this. Oh god, it's uh, it's really scary, actually. I can send you a couple of images. Like they're not from the movie because the movie actually keeps them uh keeps motor in very like, shrouded. Darkness. Yeah. Yeah. So it, it kind of looks spooky, but like there are, there's like artwork of the monster that kind of depicts what they look it's like. It's an incredible design. Like not even it looking is. at a smash point. Um It's it's those it's a very ass nice just hanging out there. <laughs> oh, what the f Oh, Shinri, you should not have shown me this. I liked him more when that it was in the one? shadows. This thing is... <laughs> oh, he's... Ugh. Oh, yeah, that last one's scary. Very but lanky. Look at, the... look at those cheeks. I just want to say a lot of people said Smash when this thing came up. Yeah. What's wrong with you? No, what's wrong with you? I just... Uh, it's... It, here's the thing. It's too scary what do you mean too scary it's really scary also like i don't know like what i don't know what its interests are I don't, can it talk it can't talk oh it's like super into like cottage core uh, like the the witchy stuff okay so the, it's like, it's very okay it's very cottage core um very like forest if it magic. wore like a little like thing on its head like a straw hat and maybe maybe like a you know a little a little gown that would be cute you know i think i feel like i th i think it's i'm I sure you could it's cute yeah, you could dress it up it's cute i don't think it's as smash particularly i i like i i think it is cute and it's in the its own only weird thing, way the only thing you would need to do is give it a little like red reindeer nose and then you could like oh. just as santa and then just ride it like Dude, as a cosplay it could, it could be my best friend i feel like it would yeah. make a good friend it would make a good friend i really do the language barrier would be a little bit difficult oh they true they it's speak. speaking is it yeah. is it is it norwegian or would it be like old norse like whatever the fuck probably old norse okay. but like i don't know if like like do, are they able to write? Maybe you can like communicate with pictures and stuff. Can it use the hands on its face? Oh no no. Um it doesn't have a okay, um look at the pictures that I sent. Um it's like it's literally if you took a human body and then just flipped them upside can, down. Can, can it use that? Can it can it yeah. articulate? Yeah, those are like fully functioning arms. Okay. Well, that's pretty fun. Um They use yeah. runes to write. Okay, so Ooh. that's that's a you know, it sounds like um, a little rough. It sounds like somebody... It's like talking to a ghost with a Ouija board or something constantly. It's a lot of time <laughs> in my day to kind of, you know, ask if they want Jack in the Box or not. You know, I just... I just, I feel like... I'm sure you could, like, just, you know, set up some... Like, <laughs> set up those fucking wall, dog and then it would, buttons? Like, point. Yeah, the dog button. Thing, yeah. <laughs> Do you want Jack in the Box? <laughs> it press the button. Yes. What do you want? French fry. <laughs> Anything else? Yes. What do you want? Cheeseburger. What do you want on it? And, and I, my, my entire home is like 893 buttons just scattered throughout the house, like a house of horrors. <laughs> it's just the whole dictionary on the wall, but it's just buttons. <laughs> oh, yeah, everywhere. all color coded. Even worse with it, it's just the <laughs> alphabet. See, now you're making it sound so endearing and cute. It because, does, like, but it that is cute, right? Yeah, you. it's trying. We have yeah. completely molded this thing into something else. This is not what it's about. But the one that you drew <laughs> looks a little bashful, you know? It's like, 
oops, I hit the I hit a French fry button when I actually meant to say hello, how are you today button, you know, and, and, and they made that and then they're a little they're a little embarrassed. I don't think it's a smash <laughs> still, but you know what? I, I, I maybe I date it. Maybe you know, maybe I maybe I just give it a whirl. Give it a whirl. See, it, it's cute. I, I yeah, I, 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 I liked the story that we've created in our heads for the thing that does this, but it's completely unfair to everybody. Oh, well, you know what? We've made stuff up this entire time. And honestly, that is so much funnier than going into like <laughs> the like actual character lore. You just look at bits yes. and pieces. OK, pass. But I date, I, you know, maybe one date and see, see where it goes. Maybe or, or a good friend or a good I would friend. smash. 100 percent respect. OK. Yeah. Jesus Christ. <laughs> okay. This is terrible. Um Yeah. Man, um where do we begin with this? Um I can start by just saying that this is a pass for me because this is yet another evil entity demon that like specifically targets children. And oh, that's does weird. It? Oh, that is weird. That is yeah, weird. it only it exclusively eats children. Um, it has a name, the pale, the pale man. The it's pale the pale man. man. Yeah, yeah. Um, but like, it has a thing for children again, and it's like, ah. Uh, no. I cannot think of a harder pass. Eating children aside, eating children yeah. aside, forget that. Um, you know, holding hands. You really can't because I'll hold their no. hand, and then they'll have one hand up, and then they can't really see in the left, you know, we're walking down the street and they're running into shit. It's getting a little, getting a little, you know, it's just precarious. It's a bit of a <laughs> bit of a nightmare. It's like, and then I can't, and would they, they feel my hand, I'd, I'd be touching an eyeball, you know, and I'd you be, could po feel I'd the be eyeball, poking like, them. rolling around. Yeah, and I'd be poking them in the eye and they'll be in fucking pain. Um, oh man. And, and wait, also- wait, wait. Hold on, hold on, real quick. Uh, speaking of that, chat, if you guys want to know what it feels like, Okay, go ahead and grab one of your hands and then cover one eye with it, but keep your other eye open and then just like look around. You will feel oh, the dude, covered dude, eye yeah. still moving around underneath the eyelids. Like you will feel that. Ugh. And imagine that, right? but like it's wet weird. and kind of squelchy. Nah, that's You exactly. made that. You literally just gave me a physical representation of what it'd be like to be with this thing. <laughs> Not to mention it's fuck ugly. Um, it's just one of the grossest things we've seen so far. Great design, but disgusting. Um, yeah, I don't think I, we, like. Go ahead. I, I think the way he acts can be kind of endearing, but uh -huh. like just the physicality of it, I don't like how the skin is so like droopy gross, and it looks yeah, like it's just like long a hundred and twenty year old fucking person. It's gross. Yeah, the wrinkles are too much. It's gross. The whole thing is gross. The concept is gross. It looks gross. It's a fucking pass. 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 He looks like melted candle wax. He like, does. Yeah. <laughs> Tusk! I didn't want to draw the face, which is why I just used the That's main even, one. This but... is way funnier. Okay, so fucking... Um, for those that don't know, okay, so this is Justin Long or, or Wallace Brighton from Tusk. Um, if you don't know who that is, it's, uh, it's the guy, you know, I'm a Mac and I'm a PC. He's Mac, okay? So he's in the movie... In the movie Tusk, for spoilers for the movie Tusk if you want to watch it, by the way, but I'm just going to talk. For the movie Tusk, it's about a man that kidnaps another man and stitches the stitches him together to, to, to genetically modify him as much as he can into a walrus. He puts, he gives him walrus teeth, he stitches like skin to him and get, puts him in the suit and he literally becomes a walrus. So you, you skip like the most important part. Okay. So the reason why the guy, like, he does he all this okay, stuff. Yeah. In the past, he was rescued by a walrus That's right. while almost drowning at sea. And in his delusion, he thinks that he needs to have sex with the walrus as a way of repaying Is that his actually... thanks I don't for remember. the walrus oh, saving Jesus. him. So what ends up happening is he goes and takes a guy to turn him into a walrus so that he too can also turn himself in a walrus and have sex with this walrus like amalgamation that he's created to like symbolically thank the original walrus that rescued him from drowning. What the fuck is who? Kevin Smith, what are you doing? <laughs> That's so gross. It, yeah, um, but like I'll like reminder, 
the guy that gets turned into a walrus is legitimately just straight up some random poor yeah. guy yep. who happened to be the wrong place at the wrong yeah. time. Yeah. If you look up the images, it's horrific. I know. I, I it's it's it is it is a rough movie. It's a rough movie. But yeah. I kind yeah. I kind of like it. Yeah. I I've never I never I it's so fucked up that I like respect it. It's really depraved, but it is fucked up. It, it's like watching a very like slow motion train wreck. Like, it is, yeah, away. and it's really, it's just, it is a fucked up movie. Um, <laughs> it's a pass. I would say that is. Uh, I mean, it's it. Mm. Oh man, he is he is gross, dude. Like we don't ever see like his full body though. You know, we the only see you... him, like, in surgery. No, you see the full body. Do you? Oh, yeah. I'm looking for I'm looking for images right Hang now, on. but I only see, like, him from, like, the, the hips and up. Look at that. Oh, that's actually a pretty good job. I mean... They, they... Do all the parts work? God, I fucking hope not. He's got, like, a tail. Like... I mean, okay, so at the end of the movie, I'm pretty sure he's put in a zoo. I think he's put Maybe. in a zoo. I think he's put in a zoo. <laughs> I think that's fucked. It's a pass. Yeah. I know gonna, it's a, I know it's still a, a man, but Jesus Christ to look at that fucking thing. When you turn the man into a walrus and put him in a zoo, I don't know. He loses points for me. <laughs> <laughs> and and not dateable. Either. I mean, you're, you're, they're they're in misery the entire time. Just you know, just no. I can't date an exploitationist. <laughs> okay, Frankenstein's monster, classic, classic or uh, horror icon kind of Halloween character. What's that? Yeah, I think Frank is so. It is just a tall. I, 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 yeah, I mean, it's just that's a big dude. Yeah, I. And they seem, I think they're kind. I think they're the nicest person on our list so far. Yep, 100%. Um, if I can like, think never, correctly. Never asked to be born, and then just one day is alive, you know, just like, oh, man, I gotta yeah. pay bills now. You I know? think they're very but, sad, and, you know, but they may, I think they would really be deserving of a partner, Frank. I think they have, like, real big himbo energy, but that's mostly <laughs> yeah. because they're, like, not fully, like, they didn't grow up with the same experiences that we did, you know, because they just woke up one day they were an adult. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah. You know, you could, you could. I don't know. I feel like it, it would be. I think it would be very sweet. Um, I think. Hmm, I would okay, just based off phys, like physicality, like the body smash, mm -hmm. but like I wouldn't date because I I don't know if I it's have a, like the it's time a lot of work to like. Yeah, to like teach someone everything. But that's kind of cute. Life. Like you're like, look, this is a light bulb, and you say light bulb. And yeah, like, but like that that gives me feelings of like I'm raising a son. Oh, I guess not you're, like oh, I'm dating that's a partner. True. That's that's very you know? true. But I, I, yeah, you're. I, I, I know what you mean. I know what you mean. Yeah. Um. Yeah, I think you're right. I think we we don't, we don't have to go into the fucking mind of 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 uh of old frank here but f physically you know tall chiseled chiseled fucking green thing i'm amazing down hugs. i'm down i'm down amazing hugs would break my back or like reshift something in my in my sp spinal column and make it so i don't have pain anymore <laughs> um every hug is like going to the chiropractor dude yeah free free stuff you know some placebo effect going on whatever yeah i mean yeah yeah frank frank of course uh smash for me easy smash Okay, Jesus Christ. <laughs> the thing. So, real quick, that's not what the thing looks like. That's one of the victims one of the, the victims. thing disguises itself as. Okay, I also drew the thing. <laughs> I didn't really know. I love know. that it has speed lines. <laughs> it's like hustling. I mean, he's going, you know, he's going. Yours is very uh, accurate to the movie. Mine is a some sludge with an eyeball, a dog collar, arms and teeth inside. But, you know, you get the point. Now, here's the thing with the thing. Yeah. What if... Okay, you and, you're like, your partner, right? Yeah. You have a partner before it. And, you know, and, and, and everything else. And then the thing takes, like, kills them and takes them over. And it, it, is it still your partner? Or is it the thing? Does it, I don't know. It doesn't. It doesn't take over their mind, though. And also, it's kind of a. 
it's a dead body. Uh, is it really a body body? Or is point? it an alien? Because I like the way that they showed it, like every part of the alien or the, the new host body ends up becoming an alien, which is why they did the blood test, you know, like they just do a small, tiny little pinprick and then like a single drop of blood set fire to it. And if it reacts to the heat, then, you know, it's an alien like it is it's not taking over the body. It's like it's not a shapeshifter, then... though. It's not a shapeshifter in any case. It's still disgusting when it takes like if it were even if it was like it turned into like the hottest fucking thing imaginable it still ends up you know melting or its chest opens up into a fucking thing of teeth and and yeah. there's just too much going on i'm not, i'm not ready I, for that i think as a one night stand it would be pretty wild oh like, yeah just I mean, imagine that's... what it could do yeah, I like mean, growing all sorts of parts and then like changing. Its I body mean, it would it would go scenarios. it would go freako freako mode, but yeah, oh, man, it's gross, dude. I'm I'm gonna put it this way, not even looking at it conceptually at this point. I'm going to look at what I know, and what I know uh, is that the thing is fucking gross. And I've seen I'm looking at all these images of like the thing. And I'm like, just man. It's one of those things where, like, if you're gonna get raunchy, you might as well go all the way. <laughs> well, I mean, the xenomorph. Night, you know? This thing yeah. is disgusting. I, it's it's the xenomorph isn't that gross. But look how it's clean. It's this thing is dirty, fucking, messy. Imagine putting your hand inside that. <laughs> like, imagine what it would feel like. It's just so like wet, dude. The you can see the way that like the skin like kind of melds together, dude. You're making it worse for me. It's gross. And also, I can't stop thinking about the fucking the thing that's made out of rocks. <laughs> oh, that thing. <laughs> the Fantastic Four win. <laughs> that would also suck. <laughs> fucking made out of rocks? Jesus Christ. I think that's legitimately one of the plot points of one of the later comics where the thing desperately wants to turn back human that's right he can't get intimate interfere. with like this lady scene because he's like, oh, I'm a monster. I'm a big I'm a fucking rock. Yeah. <laughs> Damn. The thing I don't know. There, there's there's something about like a creature that's like able to like join with you and like oh. you become. What if it part possesses you? That'd be kind of hot though. What if it possesses you? That like oh, forget forget like other things. What if it possesses you? Can it can it unpossess you or are you just are you done for? I think it would have to like reserve a portion of you to be unpossessed later because as far as I know when the thing possesses you it takes all it, of it, you. yeah you're done so you you won't yeah <sighs> exactly it's a no it's a pass it's a pass I'm so sorry the thing I'm so sorry the thing it, I keep looking at these images it is fucking disgusting I can't I can't I can't shake it bro I I, I can't, I'm not a, you know I'm you know, it's like you, Venom, you know, Venom, I, I'd go for it. You know, easy. The thing, this is too, too many legs and it's gross. I, I don't know. No. I, I don't know. I still, I still think like there's something about it that's kind of hot. Like here, here. Have you, have you seen like the remake of it? Oh, like, look at that. That's, that's kind of hot, isn't it? He's killing that guy. No, she is digging her tentacles into his back and trying to connect to his Oh, it's got a giant so mouth stomach. One. Yeah. <sighs> Jesus God. Also, it's from the it's from the remake, bro. Come on. Okay. It is, but like, that's that's what it could do. Damn, a big mouth, tentacle, tentacle monster, alien thing, uh, fleshy, but it's, it's too, too fleshy and bloody. Too fleshy and bloody. I'm not big. I'm not a big blood guy. You know. Not but big, that's where like. That, that's where the fun comes in. Yeah. <laughs> it's so like corporeal. <laughs> pass. It's a pass. You know, there's a thing they call skinship. What? Skinship in Asia. It, it's a it's a gen, it's like a generalized term for like any like skin on skin contact with like heavy tension behind it. Oh Jesus Christ! Well, <laughs> yeah. So you're implying that with the thing. Look at it. Look at it. Dude, I'm looking at it. It is repulsive. Okay. 
just, just look at how it's like towering over you. Ew! It's got On like a fucking. Like it's got bones coming out of its fucking arms and its head yeah, is upside I mean, you down. Have... You have bones too, like yeah, but on. my bones are in my body. I prefer, you know, any potential <laughs> partner to have their bones within their body and not protruding outward, unless that's like, you know, unless you're an alien, I guess. It's a pass. Which they are. Smash. They are an alien. They are an alien, but not. Yeah, I know what you mean. <laughs> you know what? I'll smash the thing. You're fucking crazy. <laughs> You're fucking crazy. Okay, the look see. I'm already liking this. Yeah. I'm already like this is um So the look see is actually a creature from an online indie horror film series called uh oh you know what called um Crypt TV. I yeah, believe. it's from Crypt TV. I'm pretty sure Dead Meat James um from the kill count was yeah was in uh is it was in this yeah um, they, have, they have a whole like monster universe i listen i'm all about like um well-dressed things and i'm looking at this guy he's got a little blazer he's got like some gloves and like a button up uh um, you want to know the lore of yeah the yeah i'd love to all right, so the Luxi is a spiritual entity that haunts people who are unable to get rid of a heavy regret or some other grievance in their life that they cannot get over. And if the Luxi appears in front of you, you have a very short amount of time to come to terms with it mm. and let go of that grievance or um, whatever that you're holding on to, some kind of a pain, you know, like maybe your husband cheated on you, right? And you, you are still like, you have like all those like angry feelings that you can't let go of, right? If you can't let go of it in time, it kills you and it takes a part of your body that represents whatever struggle you had with um, like that grievance. Um, so like one of the victims that the Luxi kills um, can't get over like the loss of her husband mm. and still has like holds onto the ring and just cannot move on with her life. <laughs> and so the Luxi kills her and takes her ring finger along with it. So it's kind of like a, a very intense version of uh, Jigsaw where he's like, oh, like you're you're not living your life to your fullest and you're holding on to all this regret and show me that you can. So he's kind of like you. a fucked up therapist. Yeah, that's a good way to put it, actually. He's kind of a <laughs> fucked up therapist. I love this guy. I love the look of him. I love that he's always smiling. He's happy to be, you know, I, I'll feel, I always feel pretty good that they're, that they're happy to be around. They dress, you know, they take care of themselves. You know, they're dressed up. And you know what? They'll help me, whether it, may, it might be some tough love, but they'll help me through some potential, you know, turmoil that I'm dealing with um, internally. Um... <laughs> I, I, I think it's, I, I think it's great. Um, yeah, it's a, it's definitely a smash for me from the look see. I, I, this might be one of my favorites so far. I love the look see. I think I like yeah. them better than Slenderman. They're, I like that they're happy. I like that they're happy because it makes me happy because now that they're passing on the energy, and then you know what? Later that day, they'll uh, deal with my three a.m. panic attacks, and they'll they'll kind of help me figure out what what that what the deal is with that. Um, <laughs> The look -see, huh? I have to yeah. watch this. I'm actually kind of interested. The shorts are very short. We're mm. talking like maybe five minutes per episode. Okay. They are very good. Yeah. Okay. Crypt TV. I had a subscription at one point. I need to, I need to re-up. Okay. Yeah. Look, see, smash. Smash. Okay. That's... Oh, my God. <laughs> I think... Have we reached my... We've reached... Oh, let's go. Some of my shitty drawings. Okay, well, I can't believe we just got to this guy. Fucking Jason. Jason! Um, <laughs> Jason. Oh, no. See, my issue with Jason is he's really... I like him with the mask on. Like, it's a smash with the mask on. The mask stays on kind of deal. Yeah. Um, but, man, he... I mean, he's fucked. He is fucked up with the mask off. I... I don't know for me. I think it would have to be like just this, just a, a pass. Okay, here's the thing. Like, he's just a guy. 
it is just kind of a guy, you know. but, but but big, tall, stoic, you know, um, no, I don't want, actually, you know what, I might have to do the first ever Smasher Pass comparison moment. <laughs> because I'm going right. to tell you why one of these works <laughs> and why one of these doesn't work. Oh my god. Okay. Now, Why does he have veins on his... <laughs> okay, so... <laughs> it's Jason versus Michael Myers. Now, conceptually, in a lot of ways, they're very similar. Big, tall, stoic, um, uh, slasher killer, masked kind of person. Yeah. Okay. Now, the difference is that Michael Myers underneath is actually not like a fucked up monster thing from hell. He's just allegedly just a person just a dude and his demeanor i I'm, i just watched halloween in membership his demeanor i'm kind of michael myers is kind of hot i like that he it, jason jason always like there are times where jason runs and he has a little bit of panic a little bit of intensity to him michael myers yeah. doesn't give a fuck ever not a fucking shit never and that's kind of awesome I, hmm, I suppose, like, okay, I, I, I think that's awesome. I agree in the context of like an ar a character archetype, right? Mm. But like, there are too many like killers who do that. The walking you know? thing. Like, wh where's the personality? Yeah, like, but Michael Myers separates... started it. I, I suppose, but like, I, I still don't know who he is. You know? But you can, you can find out. Just gotta give him time to open up, you know. He, I think he's a real slow burn, long con kind of guy. You know, maybe he'll open I up mean, eventually. If he ever I says think words. The only thing he's gonna be opening up is like your chest cavity. No, oh, come on, listen, bro. This is the guy that said to smash the thing. You gotta, you gotta give me some leeway here. That's just a dude in a mask, and he's and he's stoic, and he's tall. He's a tall, broad, stoic, silent type. But that's he's that's mysterious. The thing. He's he's just a dude in the mask. Oh, you know? I mean, like... but, that's, but he's but <laughs> but he but he's like okay, I get that. You're right. I don't care about the dude in there. I care about the yes. idea. And the idea, the idea, oh. the idea of Michael Myers is cool. Cause like, you know, the, with the, the outfit and the mask and stuff, and he's like this stoic thing. It's like, if he takes off the mask, he goes, hey, uh, I'm Michael Myers. Forget it, for, for, I hate that. But it's, 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 about, it's, about, it's about how they present themselves and how they present themselves as this, this slow walking, stoic, mysterious type kind of character. And it's okay, cool. Okay. It's cool. I I don't know. I, I just think I think there is an essence to it that I think is cool. Like the difference between Batman and Bruce Wayne. The, the exactly. Idea of Batman is hot. Michael Myers. Who gives a shit about Bruce Wayne, right? Yeah. Okay. No. When you say it that way, that makes sense. Yeah. The the idea and the concept of Michael Myers, I would say. Right. Right. There you go. Okay. Now with Jason, a bit different. I like the hockey mask. I like his outfit, but he's a little bit rougher around the edges. I don't find any kind of elegance with Jason. He's he's yeah. a little bit more brutish, and also he looks like fucking sloth from the Goonies. Um, I'm, <laughs> I'm just I'm just not, you know. If we, I'm just I'm just not into it. I mean, it, there's just something about it. I like mask characters and stuff, but Jason is shown to kind of he removes his mask a lot. Like he's not he's not exactly devoted to the mask as not as much as Michael <laughs> Myers is. Michael Myers is the mask. Right, that's his thing. He's very mysterious. Jason, it's like ah, he, he lost his mask. No, it's this fucking ugly thing again. You know, so I'm 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 not as sold on Jason compared to Michael Myers, but they're very similar. I would have to agree agree with you on that one, but like I think the big thing that's like separating for me is the fact that Jason is like mentally just a kid. Oh, I guess that's true. Yeah, he's like he's very... he drowned. Yeah, he drowned at the lake. That's right. Um, when he was at camp, very know? childlike level of intelligence, like very exactly. And yeah. like mom, the mommy issues thing. I don't know. That's that's not good either. Yeah, yeah. No, it's a good point. It's a good point. I know I, people like Jason. A lot of people think Jason's hot. I, was like, I know we're going into the science and shit because people d design wise, people say, oh, see Jason, like oh, hockey mask, big guy, cool, hot. But like, I'm, I'm just, I'm, just, you know, I, I think it's a little bit more interesting when we were like, okay, but he takes off the mask and he looks like that under the mask. You know, you, you got, people need to think. People need to think mm. about these things. I don't think they, they think enough for, for the result. Michael Myers, you know, the mask came off once um, and it showed his face and whatever. But I, I, I never agreed with that. But I mean, I don't know. 
<laughs> I like Michael Myers. Also, I think he's kind of funny. Yeah, somebody just said the shape also has a sense of humor. I think yeah. Remember uh, in, the, in the first Halloween, uh, he killed a dude. Uh, there's you know these two fucking two, uh, a couple having sex, and one of them left, and he kills the dude, and he comes back to the bedroom, and he's wearing a yeah. bed sheet with the dude's glasses over the bed sheet. Why would he do that? Because he's just going to. He just ends up killing that girl anyway. But he's 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 kind of funny. He does have a little bit of a flair. He's got a. He's kind of funny. He's got you know. He's got. He's, I, I'm you know. I'm, I'm not saying. I thought it was funny. I liked that. It's like, you know. I, I Jason does not have a sense of humor. I don't think. No, we haven't seen it. Not really. Nothing like that. Nothing to that level of like silliness. <laughs> and no, nothing's funnier than like a person that tries and succeeds in being funny and they don't have to say a word very mime yeah. you know but you know you, I find it endearing <sighs> Michael Myers is a huge smash for me I, I, I just I love that character uh, Jason it's a pass same damn smash okay. Michael pass Jason damn okay I'm glad I sold yeah. you I'm glad I sold you I think <laughs> this is all of it okay there's Michael Oh, it's my the okay. concept. It's the concept. Right, exactly. Oh. <laughs> Ghostface. Everyone wants to s fucking Ghostface. Okay, everybody. But let's 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 look a little bit into this real quick. Yeah. Okay. This is going to be tricky because in Scream, Ghostface is always somebody different it's always a whodunit it's always a random different person right it ghostface is not a thing now i think the way i want to look at this yeah. is look at ghostface not as a person one of the 58 people that become becomes ghostface but let's just look at them as the costume with the voice that they have over the telephone and that he's okay. just an entity i feel like that makes it easier and makes it more of like a a you know because like how can you be like because how would we how would we judge this if it were like because who would it be because the whole point is a who done it so you don't know who Ghostface is so let's just keep it in 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 you know suspend our disbelief and keep it as a concept rather than you know an actuality. This is the hard one of the hardest smashes ever. If that's the case, if it, with me with me going off of that with that his voice is his voice is awesome and I love I love the look and also he's kind of an idiot and I think that's funny. I yeah. Uh, I'm ah oh man, I'm gonna L myself pretty hard with this one. Okay. I say smash, but that's because I'm biased as like the the recent like a couple of months ago the recent Ghostface trend thing has like given me a different oh, vibe of Ghostface. Oh, have you seen like all shapes and forms of Ghostface? Oh no no, uh, I sent you some pictures of the Ghostface hmm. trend, so <laughs> take a look. <laughs> Wait, what the? Fuck is what the yes. hell is this? There's a trend where um, people pretend to be victims of Ghostface, and then they're on the ground falling over. And what Ghostface does is steps over them, grabs them by the hair, pulls their head up, and takes a picture uh, of them. Oh my goodness! Yeah, th this is like I, I, I mean, I clearly ooh. don't have an unpopular opinion. Everybody, I feel like this is probably the highest of them all. Everybody is attracted to the look of Ghostface. Yeah. Whether you're a Dead by Daylight player or a horror fanatic or just any, for some reason, there's I don't know. I feel like I wherever I wherever I go, everyone is like, man, Ghostface is hot. Twitter, you know, blows up with art every Halloween about Ghost Ghostface. Um, <laughs> I I can see why you would have been swayed. You what you wouldn't have done. You would have said Smash. Otherwise, you would have you would have just gone for. I, just... I guess for me, like, I don't really know too much because I actually haven't seen too many of the movies. The only, like, real experience I have with Ghostface is from the Scream movies, okay. which are comedies. So, like, yeah, I have like, yeah. the wrong impression of Ghostface already because I've not seen the originals. Yeah, but he's... <laughs> oh, the scary movies? Yeah. Oh, my... So you... Wait, but that's... Oh, yeah, the scary movies. Yeah. <laughs> that's the one I saw. So. Oh, my... God. I never saw the originals. The, I just watched it. <laughs> by the way, that those movies do not hold up. My God, they could not make that today. Um, <laughs> Jesus Christ! No, I hear you. Oh, well, I mean that's funny. I mean it's he's funny. I I like I like Ghostface. I mean it's a it's kind of a um it's 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 an easy one. It's a smash for me with Ghostface. We actually only have one more. Okay. Okay. 
Yeah, it was oh, Bash. Oh That's my Bash god. Too. Oh no, not this one. Wait, well, come on, where why is he? There we go. Come on, come on, buddy. Okay, you <laughs> actually need to explain to me what this one is, because I actually don't I'm not familiar with this one. Uh this is uh I thought this was gonna be like <laughs> <laughs> okay, so this is actually from a really bad movie based off an interpretation of one of Stephen King's horror books called The Langoliers, and it is basically a floating nugget with teeth that just eats everything. Dude, I'm pretty sure these things were in Rick and Morty. I'm not even kidding. Uh, yes, some of the creatures in Rick and Morty are like. Based oh, this off was of totally Rick based off of. What the? Fu I'm looking at it's the a... images. What the? Yeah, so basically, like, I kid you not, they are, like, they're supposed to be, like, some fifth dimensional entities that's able to, like, literally eat reality. And, like, there's a scene where they eat, like, the universe, as, like, around it. Um, Do they but talk? the movie is really bad. Uh, no, they scream. Oh, Jesus. Yeah. I need also, to, the I kind of want to watch this. The teeth look like teeth, but they're more like chainsaws, and the teeth, like, run run along the lips of, like, the mouth. Oh my god! It's so bad. Like, uh, they're, you, they're like, enormous. You need to make a dream. They are. They're huge. And they, like, literally, they will devour anything that comes across. You know, so if they, like, they if they nick your arm, your arm is gone. Like, completely. Just wiped from existence. Are you fucking... Oh, Jesus. I kind of want to watch the movie now. You really sold it to me, by the way. It's it's so bad. <laughs> Make it a drinking game, but like it's free. Really Dude, bad. yeah, that sounds kind of fun. This looks This looks funny as fuck. Okay, Lang oh my God, the Langoliers. Tanga. So oh, it's Jesus. Floating Tanga. <laughs> Who the fuck said that? Ew. No. Come on. Oh, my God. Um. What you said about the teeth is 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 uh very concerning. Yes. Um just a little bit. I I you know, typically when I look for a partner, uh probably one of the prerequisites at least for me is that I don't want them to devour the universe. It's just not really um not really my thing. Yeah. Um also it's it's all teeth. I I that's it's all teeth. It doesn't look yeah. very fun to be around. You said all they do is scream. They eat the universe. This is one of the worst ones yet. Yep. This is one That's of the, all they do. This is one of the worst ones yet. <laughs> this might be... I don't know if it is the worst one, but it's it's very much... Um, it's very much uh, a concerning uh, aspect. I mean, let me try and find... The, what's good things about it? The only good thing that I could think about it is once you get past the teeth, like the ridges inside the mouth would be kind of hot. <laughs> Well, you just roll around in like it's fucking gum line. They're uh, enormous. Yeah, sure. Roll around. We'll, also, we'll use that word. Okay, I get it. But but like, I mean, what happens when it eats you? Do you know? Oh, you just get wiped from existence. Oh, maybe this thing's. Wait a second. Maybe this thing's kind of awesome. <laughs> Hold on a sec. You didn't tell me I get wiped from existence. Yeah, like not a trace of you left over. He just enters the void. I become lost media. Yeah. <gasps> Ooh. Damn. Very mysterious. Um. <laughs> Jesus Christ. That yeah. That's a whole new level of one night stand. One night stand, and you're gone from reality. It's you're gone. Um, I wonder where you would end up though. True. What? I I mean, I haven't seen the movie. Uh, you may. I want to see after these, these images because that is the. Is that real? Are those real images from the film? That. Yeah, those, that's CG. That that's what that's why I'm saying it's bad. Like the CG does not hold. That up. looks good, bad. No, no, no. It's bad, bad. I really, it's even I worse in motion. I love to look at that. That's funny as fuck. <laughs> <laughs> um, it's 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 a pass. It's a pass. I just, I mean, what what is there to really say? It's a pass. Yeah, I say pass, but it's mostly because it's like just a beast it's not like it, you can't like have conversations with no them, exactly know? yeah there's not a whole lot to do like what well, you can't talk to it it screams it uh, wipes you from reality yeah like you can't you know lie there spooning it petting it on the yeah, head you can, yeah, talking you can, about you can't yeah. spoon a langolier yeah i mean you could try but you, you won't last long once. yeah you spoon yeah you, 
<laughs> Fucking hell. That's funny oh, as fuck. Man. Langoliers. Lang Langoliers. Is that, is that everything? Don't do it. Don't do it. <laughs> I, I know it looks like silly, but it's just so bad. Like the the main story itself does not make sense. Dude. We'll see. <laughs> um I mean that concludes that that concludes it. That's that's all of them. I think that's a, that's a good amount of time. I did. I briefly want to go over. It's like, was yeah, I, I'm curious. I'm curious what people think. Is is this as as fucked up as you thought it would be, or is it? Because listen, between me and Shinri, and I was watching. Uh, I, I, I said I was watching a clip. There's the the say so versus unsay so, right? That or oh. that 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 sort of uh, dynamic. <laughs> um or like dichotomy right but it's like yeah. you know but, but i think i feel like i think we're both reasonably fucked up uh after after this um but yep. uh, you know but but it, 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 it was pretty tame well i mean listen i well i mean we could go like oh man look at that fucking that <laughs> <laughs> and, and then i just want to you know but but yeah i think i think Shinri, I think with your um, analysis, I like I like the way um, you really deep dive into it. I can't do that. Yeah, I can't do that. I like I like that you kind of you you. I mean you you are you're you're pedal to the metal. You're pedal to the metal, <laughs> and I respect it. I can't, the closest, the craziest thing I said was the Dementor ship. But I mean, what? I mean, who the fuck? I mean, when you look at it. It's a <laughs> come on. But yeah. No, you're you're completely you're so true. For I that. mean that is that is such a that's the most reasonable point I think we both brought today. Um, I, li I this was fun. I liked I, I you know I I wanted to I want to do this with you because you you have not been shy to to like horror movie monsters oh, no, yeah. and and just video game ghosts and shit like that. I was curious where you stood, and honestly, I'm not even remotely surprised. You you kind you kind of you kind of just knocked it out of the park. I I don't think you said it, like even even the stuff with the with the thing, you know. I was like, yep, yep. You know, I'm like, yeah, yeah, sure. <laughs> Shinri said it. I mean, you know, it's fine. I I sent I sent Bettle some pictures of the the thing in like the remake, yeah. and there are scene there's just some scenes that are just so hot. Like, <laughs> it looks so good. <laughs> I don't know. It just looks really good. <laughs> this this fucking guy's out of control. I think like the to be honest, I think one of the big reasons why we ended up with this is because we were looking for like iconic horror. Mm, monsters, yeah, yeah, you know? yeah. I feel like if we opened it up to just like if like you know if the battalion want to like throw like hey how about this? What are you guys takes on mm. this monster? Right, and it could be just anything from like you know from games to like short stories, and, right? Like, fiction and all that like creepy pasta. Like oh my god. Dude, the, the the world of horror monsters is so it's, vast. It's literally endless. Yeah. Oh, I actually had another one. I, for, oh. I forgot to save it. Um, <laughs> right, let me try and find the image, but we can talk about it briefly. Art the clown from Terrifier. Do you know Art the clown? No. Look up, look up Art the clown. Clown. Okay. Oh, he looks so good. <laughs> what do you think? Ah. Of, what do you think of Art the Clown? I would not smash, but he looks like he'd be a great person to just have a beer with. <laughs> he's a goofy little guy. He's a goofy. He is. He's goofy. Um, like, like he looks so. He looks so precious in this one. Look at that. I think he's cute. I, oh, I think it's that's the cute. Look at the hat, like the way that he's just kind of like sitting on his head and he's just like so politely sitting there like this guy's a goofball. I love him, dude. He, I think he's a funny guy. He also doesn't say anything. Um, He's got that kind of mime like quality to him, but he's got like that. The body language at the flourish. Yeah, like, he's, 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 got, got he's he definitely was kind of like a mime. He's got like mime sort of um, um characteristics and i and i think i i like i like art the clown i think he's a goofy guy i'd smash art the clown i think that's the that's would, my favorite horror clown i think is art the clown i would be best buds with art the clown i don't know if i'd smash no, i mean he i mean yeah i mean oh he's so funny looking 
He's caught. Like, he look, look at that smile. He look, he's just having a time. He's having a good time. He's having a good time. Look at him. Let me look at Art Clown. He does some horrible things, but you know we don't talk about th that part of him. Don't oh, we he's snarky. He's got little, the little eyebrows and the smile. Oh, he's funny. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> he's he's a, he's a goofy looking guy. <laughs> he needs he needs a dental plan, but you know, baby steps. I just realized he has a like a a Zentai suit going on. Like, oh yeah, I thought he was I bald. Thought he... Yeah, I thought it was bald, but no, like that's a suit. Wait, that means he probably has hair. <gasps> Ooh, I wonder what kind of hair he has. So he's got like, maybe he's got hair. Oh, curious. Interesting. Interesting. Okay, or decline. Well, that's the, yeah, okay, so we got that. All right, well, yeah, I mean, <laughs> I won't take up any more of your time. I, Shinri's, Shinri's on break, and I, I really appreciate you coming out and doing this. Uh, probably the most um, unsay so thing I'll do for sure. Um, and then for you, it's uh, Friday. So, I, you know, I think it just kind of fall, falls into that, <laughs> falls into that yeah, line, yeah. you know. Um, Thank you for having me. No, of course, of course. I, I, I need to do more like of these comparison tier lists with other, with other members of Tempest. Um, I feel, I feel, you know, where, where it would land because it's like, not even like monster stuff. By the way, this was meant for like Halloween. This is a Halloween. We're still doing spooky season for this week, so this was kind of a last Halloween oh. hurrah. Um, yeah. Because nothing says Halloween like monsters. So. Um, on November third. On November third. Yep. Yep. <laughs> um, but yeah, I, I hope you guys have fun. Um, I don't. I don't really know what else to say. Uh, but thanks, Shinri, for coming. And we. Uh, we could have not. You know, the thing, but better, the, the, better luck next time. I mean, the only th better luck next time. Yeah. I, I, the only thing I want to say real quick, though, is yeah. I want to see the fan art. <laughs> For every single monster battle has said Smash to, I want to see the fan well, art. Well, there's already one with me and Michael Myers. And even before this stream, I, there was one with really? me, like, where he was, like, carrying me like a bride. Oh, that's it, it really was cute. cute it was bro. cute. Yeah, it was cute. <laughs> Oh god! Oh, oh god. god! I'm kind of horrified now. <sighs> Don't you just love a guy who can sleep you off your feet? Like dude, that, dude, yeah, he's big and big and strong. What can I say? Um, yeah. All right, folks. Well, thank you guys uh, to all the gifted people. Uh, I really appreciate all the gifts and the and the super chats. I know I didn't get to see it. Uh, I did not even put a super chat reading on for this week. But you guys know who you are, and I really appreciate it. I hope you guys have liked this style of of uh, stream for today. Um, and uh, that kind of concludes this little thing. Shinri, if you want to say anything else, you can. And that's it for me. So thanks, guys, for watching. Yeah. Uh, nothing. I'm on break until, like, the end of next week. So nothing from me. But, yeah, hope you guys have fun. Okay. Well, thank you again, Shinri, for coming out and doing this uh, on your break. And uh, everybody else, I can find you a redirect. And I will see you tomorrow with a karaoke. Karaoke. Let's go. Uh, which I've not done in a while. So please uh, be, bear with me um, as yeah. I remember how to sing. Okay, all right. <laughs> well, I'm going to outro. Um, but again, thank you guys for watching and see you later. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Bye, everyone. Bye-bye.